Okay, welcome to Ecclesfield Handbell Ringers and thank you for joining me in this interview for HRGB. And we have around the table Rona Gerger, Lynn Dawson, Molly Barker, Maureen Dewhurst, Sue Blackett. And welcome to everybody here. When did you all start handbell ringing? So, should we start with Rona? Well, I yeah. started when I was in junior school. Um, I rang for a few years, a couple of years, and then I had to get back for about 40 years. And I've been back three years now. Okay. And Lynn? I started in 1980. Yeah. Rang until 85 when I disappeared off to university, came back at the holidays. Um, disappeared off down south, didn't ring for four years because I couldn't find a five octave off table team. Moved to Surrey, um, joined Warnham um, in Sussex and then joined Hamilton before moving back to Sheffield in 2002 and picking up where I left off. So completely full circle. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and Molly? I started at school in 1966. Um, rang until I left school, had a couple of years off for college and came back to the village team and have been here ever since. Okay. Um, and I started at school in the 60s. Um, I left school in 1964 and joined the village team mm -hmm. and I've been there ever since. Okay. I brought my daughter to join to do her guide handball ringing badge in 93, mm. um, which she did, but the, you don't get away with just sitting and watching at Ecclesfield. <laughs> I had to join in. Yeah. So eventually she did her badge and she left and I've stayed and been here ever since. Okay, so quite a big history between you all. <laughs> and Ecclesfield team itself, how many years has that been going? Eighteen eighty. Well, we thought two thousand and four. Yeah, we thought yeah. two thousand and four. Yeah. But we found a photo. Or someone brought us a photograph. Yeah. From the eighteen eighties. Yes. Yeah. So. And that was in the competition time, and we've just been looking at some wonderful photos, which go back through all of those years. Okay. Um, so when you look back over all of your handbell ringing years, what's your most memorable moments from? Ringing. Don't know about ringing, but I remember Rosie driving a minibus down to Siren Sester and we overtook a milk float. <laughs> <laughs> that was the only thing we overtook on that journey. <laughs> I don't think um, early on we rang in the um, City Hall in Sheffield, oh, okay. which is a, a lovely hall. Mm. Yeah. Uh, but we were so close to the, to the edge of the stage, I thought we were going to fall off. Really? Mm. Okay. But I was on the end, so yeah. I was nearest the edge. <laughs> but I really thought it would be cool. But you've also produced some CDs as well, yes. so was that quite fun to do? No. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I, I, came, I came back up from Surrey to, to listen to the recordings. I wasn't actually playing on it. Yeah. And the amount of takes they had to keep <gasps> doing from various tunes was unbelievable. Yeah. got boring, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. The, the first one, yeah. heavy metal, was... Quite yeah. hard work. Yeah. After we, we, when we did the Christmas one, that was much easier. I think the recording techniques had got easier. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, so a bit more slick. So we, we did that one quite quickly. Okay. Yeah. That was all right. But did the you, first one yeah. we recorded was wasn't digitalised. Oh. So that was that was when the record was made. Okay. Um, so you had to just keep going over and yes. over and yeah. Mm, okay. Yeah, in a studio? No, in the in school hall. Okay. Norman Chadwick, weren't it? Yes, oh, okay. yes, he came to record it and we did okay. it in the, in the school hall at Ecclesfield. Okay. So, um, the other two were done in here, weren't they? Oh, okay. Yeah. So we're in the Gatti Hall today, which is where you practice mm -hmm. and where you have concerts and things. Yeah. Okay. How many concerts do you normally have in the year? Or well, we used one? to have two. We used to have yeah. a Christmas one and a summer one, but we found the summer one wasn't getting as well attended. Yeah. We, we wanted to do a summer one because Christmas is lovely and we get lots of people, but and everyone wants handbells at Christmas. Yeah. Um, but we wanted to play something else besides Christmas music. But yeah. And we did it for a few years in the summer. Do any of you play any other musical instruments? Not anymore. No, no. Yeah. You, you like piano. The piano? Okay. Best. You sing the recorder as a kid. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no. Choirs or singing or anything? Or? Well, I, I, yeah. I'm a dancing teacher. We do okay. dancing and singing, but yeah. you, it, 
it's lovely to play handbells because I can't play an instrument very mm. well. But to play, to be able to actually make a decent rendition of something mm -hmm. like Hallelujah Chorus or Dan Busters yeah. or all these is amazing to me. Yeah. You know, that it's just to be part of that, mm. to make really good music mm -hmm. is wonderful, I think. Yeah, and it's that teamwork, that's isn't right. it? That's right. Couldn't possibly yeah. do it on my own. Yeah, oh, brilliant. Thank you. So I think that's well, wonderful. I have to agree yeah. with you, because yeah, mm -hmm. I don't play another instrument either. Yeah. And it is, it's great. You don't need to when you play it. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it is, it's all inclusive, isn't it? So you can just yeah. sort of start. Well, it's social anyway. as well, isn't it? It's so, yeah. very team. You've, you've got to be a team, there's no doubt about yeah. it. Mm. Right. And then we've got a change ring in team as well, they tend to go together, don't they? Yeah. Fan okay. soloists sometimes, you know, people who are really good at music don't fit in. No. Because it's, they, it's they want to either do it all or they can't wait for the rest of it. They're not listening to everyone yeah, else. It's it's and it's that listening. Yeah. They play the lot, don't they? <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> It's not every pianist. No, not every pianist. Every pianist. Every pianist. No. <laughs> Huge generalisation. <laughs> um, so, um, do you read music? How do you how do you ring? We, we only read yeah. treble clef. Okay. We're reading one line and one space. Okay. Do you mark your music up, or how do you? Depends what you mean. We don't. Mm. We don't have left hand and right hand. We okay. don't put colours on and have dots no. on our hands or anything. Okay. But, um, but if, if there has to be a particular arrangement, yeah. because you've got four notes in a row and you've only got two hands, so somebody else has got ring yeah. going on more bells, then it be marked up for ring and more. Yeah, ring and yeah. Two, that sort of thing. Yeah. We don't okay. mark up what's <laughs> yeah. not normal. Yeah. Okay. Bells for you. Yeah. Okay. Um, and what technique do you use to ring? The right oh, one. table. <laughs> The right one. Yorkshire, <laughs> the old, old way. Do you? The, the this, old this, way. Yeah. This part of someone extra going, oh, that's new. Not seen that oh, before. Oh, it's very Not seen what before? Oh, it's the very way you traditional. Ring. We've yeah. been ringing like this for 100 years. <laughs> yes. And is it the Yorkshire dog set that you use, or how do you, how do you have your bells laid out? Just. Yeah, mainly just as a, as a York, Yorkshire, yeah. Yorkshire, Yorkshire yeah. off-table off yeah. way of bringing bells. Mm. Yeah. When looking at the photos of Ecclesford, you can see that that has just, as you say, been going since 1800s. So you carried on this amazing yeah. tradition of off-table ringing, which you know is quite popular really up in the north, isn't it? And I mean, I ring off-table now in the south, but not in a long set. How do you manage to cover all of the bells, especially if you've got someone sick or...? Ah, well then you have yeah. a very special person. Okay. You just rotate around the, around the do room. Do you? Know what week it is. <laughs> so do you, can you all sort of fit in anywhere? No. no. okay. So it's we can. Yes, we can. So we can. Well, let's yeah. be fair, just, like, none of us can play James's place. No, no that's <laughs> James is our, our bass bass bottom bass ringer, bass ringer who okay. has a whole octave all to himself. So how many middle. bass bells does he ring? All octave. All all octave. octave. <laughs> okay. Mm. He goes he goes from yeah. from that C to that really big thing. Okay. Mm. And, and that's his normal bells. He will play all of those all okay. by himself. And do you normally have your own place? Normally. Yeah. yeah. yeah because just, you take yeah. on the persona of that place. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You play the bass ringer or the door triple. So you, you're sort of channeling whoever was there in the past, you know. Yeah, but the yeah. talk a lot. <laughs> the bass don't say anything. Oh, no. Oh, no, of course it does. <laughs> Actually, no, 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 Sue's right, actually. Well, yeah, you are. <laughs> okay. Yeah, the bass can't get a word in it. <laughs> and what do you do if there's too many ringers? Do you ever have that? Oh, well, we're okay. just very lucky we've got duplicate and triplicates okay. and, yeah. and, 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 and a spare set of bells and a set of bells so oh, we can usually squash them in the same okay. way. There's room on the table more, well, that's a problem. And do you have chimes, bell plates or anything? No. I swear. No. <laughs> Yeah, but that was necessity, wasn't it? <laughs> so 
So that was for health rather than for bells. Yes. yes. <laughs> okay. um, and I understand you've got a U3A group as well in Ecclesfield. Rona was saying. It, it, started, U3A members. Okay. Yeah, it, it started off as a, as a U3A group. Yeah. Uh, and there were quite a few of them, but then some of them left. So there's about five who are actually U3A members. So it's, yeah. it's not a U3A team. Okay. Because other members of the concert yeah. team play. And we actually mm -hmm. just picked up two youth members as well. Yeah, which Rona was talking about mm -hmm. earlier, which is quite. Good. Do they enjoy their ringing, do you think? Yes, yes, yes. Yes. <laughs> they, keep, they keep coming back, so we haven't right yet. Yeah. 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 No, they're frightening me a bit. <laughs> Are they? <laughs> okay. um, what's, do you have a favourite piece of music to ring? Oh. That depends on who you ask. Okay, well, we'll have to go around the table now. Oh, I've got a lot of favourites. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's really difficult yeah. to pick yeah. a yeah. favourite. Yeah. Yeah. I suppose the one that we're known for mm. is probably Caliph. Okay. Or Dan Busters. Or Dan Busters. Yeah. But I think Caleb, Caleb's probably our party Caleb's piece. supposed to be our party piece. Because no one else rings it. Okay. Mm. It was I, one of, I like Morse. Mm. Do you? Yeah. I like Schubert's Serenade at the moment. Oh, Schubert's Serenade yeah. out again. Okay. And it just, just sort of reminds me of school days again. Mm. Back, to, back to Mr Mitchell. Because mm. he arranged a lot of that type of music okay. for the bells. Yeah. yeah. Um, I like what's the flowers for that reason, yes. I think, because it yeah. reminds me of school. Yeah. That's our first round yeah. at school. That goes back to you more than oh, me right. for school. Mm. So you've still got music that you had at school, which yeah. you bring out yeah. today and ring. Yeah. 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 Which We've still got the competition music. Yes. Yeah. Um, and you still ring from the competition music? Or? Yeah, occasionally yeah. we do. Yes, because we rank um, the Rydal Rydal. Rydal. <laughs> Did <Clotches>. you? <laughs> Clotches. Clotches. Clotches the um, that was a yeah. competition piece, it's wasn't it? it? Yeah, that's what the old team used to call it when mm. the main one too. Oh, yeah, we, we don't call pieces of music by their proper titles. We, yeah. we, we make things up for yeah, them. We do. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> and how about more popular music? Do you ring any sort of... Things like that. Popular in terms of probably TV themes or things like okay. that. So we've, we've, yeah. we've got the Morse theme, yeah. for which we've got permission from Barrington for long yeah. for. Okay. Um, we've got Wallace, Wallace, and Wallace, Wallace, Wallace and Gromit. Oh, okay. <coughs> yeah. That's yeah. Nice well. Well. Magnificent yeah. Men. What do you perform in concerts normally? A mixture or? Yeah. Yeah, we, we <coughs> usually have one or two yeah. big pieces yeah. that. Yeah. Um, yeah. We still try and keep some of the old marches and waltzes okay. going. Slipping yeah. a tango here and there. Yeah, yeah. chicken a tango. Mm. Okay. And when you're performing in a concert, do you join in with other musical people or is it just for we yourselves? Have, we have a tradition yeah. at Christmas. Yeah. We, we have um, a brass band, a mm. local brass band, who come yeah. and play with us. And um, they've got a version of Jingle Bells that we're going okay. in. And we still, yeah, we like that. Yeah. Because mm. we've we got a version of Jingle Bells. Yeah. It wasn't as good as theirs. <laughs> Um, so we had it arranged for us and now we do play it in duet, in inverted yes. commas, between the handbell team and, and the brass band team. Okay. It tends to be a bit of a race to who can get to the end first. <laughs> yes. um, unfortunately, they're louder than us, so they tend to drown us out. Mm. <laughs> What's your experience of any international handbell events? Have you been to any of those? Liverpool. Liverpool, Liverpool yeah. Liverpool, yeah. 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 Okay. 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 As a team, yeah. Liverpool's the only international symposium. Yeah. Did you ring? A piece yeah, together. We were asked to demonstrate awesome. Yorkshire yeah. off table ringing to okay. the rest of the delegates. Ah. Um, and we did quite, we must have been on for about an hour, weren't yeah. we? Yeah. yeah, we did quite a lot. Yeah. We did quite a bit. Okay. But it was quite funny because it was it was London Olympic year. Okay. And I'm, I'm a keen swimmer, and Rebecca mm -hmm. Addington had made the 800 final, so we're not going on until she's swung her final. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. it was one of the yeah. riders in the dressing room. We had to have a swimming. Yeah, <laughs> 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 I could watch her swimming. 